Uh, speaking of tools, let's talk about gay fire starter and alt-right Annie Lennox cosplayer, Milo Yiannopoulos. <laughs> Milo just landed a quarter million dollar book deal with Simon & Schuster. Have you heard of them? Yeah, the shoe company. Sure. Well, uh, he put himself on the map after trolling SNL actress Leslie Jones with racist and sexist insults and getting kicked off Twitter for inciting his disgusting followers to harass her. He has perfected his craft at Breitbart.com with columns like this. Dear straight people, I'm officially giving you permission to say gay, faggot, and queer. No, 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 it makes sense. It's like reclaiming those words in an empowering way, except the total opposite. Ah, uh, Milo, as our Southern mothers would say, bless your heart. Oh. Sweetie, you're on your way to becoming another Ann Coulter, the godmother of being as loud as possible without mattering. <laughs> he claims to be an important alt-right thinker, even though no respected political pundit on either side of the aisle would ever quote him. But I will. Did I get this quote right, darling? They said banning me from Twitter would finish me off. Just as I predicted, the opposite has happened. Did it hurt Madonna being banned from MTV in the 90s? Oh, you poor sweet thing. You gotta get your facts straight. Justify My Love was banned from MTV because it pushed boundaries with bisexuality and androgyny. You were banned from Twitter for being a clickbait racist. Uh, <laughs> congratulations, Milo, on being the one gay fan Madonna would disown. <laughs> so take a bow, dear, and bless your heart. Oh. <laughs>